Hello, how are you doing? This is Professor Al Zaidi, and I'm doing today a demonstration on how to live broadcast on YouTube. And we are going to use a program called XSplit uh, Broadcast, and um, we are going also to fix the black screen problem with the program when you are recording. First, um, I'm going to demonstrate on my YouTube channel that um, I, I created for, um, you know, small movies and clips um, and testing purposes also um, so uh, this this uh, live broadcast going to be on um, on movie and clips as um, the video the full video for this um, demonstration going to be on my uh, screen and my channel and my website um, which is ahmedalzadi.com so let's start it First, you need to go to um, the website, which is XSplit, and download uh, the application. So, this is the, the website. You download the free copy. You don't need to buy it. Yes, it asks you for upgrade, but you don't need to buy it. Um, and you download the la latest version, and um, you install it to your PC. Now, I'm, I'm going to demonstrate on PC, not Mac. So, double-click install to uh, the PC give it time I will come back after installation complete we are in the setup process choose your um, country and language into the setup screen next choose the where you want it next next and install easy process just to install the application give it time I'm going to come back after the installation complete we are back the setup has been uh, completed launch the broadcast we will finish so we can run it for the first time It's going to ask you to register and uh, log in. I already registered uh, my account. You can register with with any of these uh, social media, or um, you can log in immediately if you already have an account. Uh, I've already had an account. I already tested this before. So um, we are running the application or starting the application. I need to activate. Now, this is going to um, give you an option to buy with, you know, to upgrade so they can do money. However, we are going to use the free version. So we are going to continue, wait for it and for 10 seconds, then, then you continue. And technically, you are seeing my screen because I already fixed the problem with that. Um, let me uh, give you an idea how this works. Um, let me turn off this. Go to screen number four. I don't have anything in screen number four. I have in screen number one. However, I'm going to have something on screen number four. So, how to add um, your input by so how to add an input or choose a place you are going to add. Choose whether game capture or a device or a screen capture so you can choose a video and you can choose your webcam I can um, have my webcam right here and it's showing over here that this is the webcam that I chose um, I can remove it if I want to where I, I will go ahead and I say click screen capture and they will ask for you to choose the screen you choose the entire screen or part of the screen whatever you like and it's over here you can see it you can see my mouse and you just increase the size of it and you're done now this is I need to remove it this is uh, for how to um, have your screen um, let me remove this I will have to choose another place another screen over here nice place okay 
now this is a other screen, my other screen that has part of it. Um, now you need to go into uh, in terms of the output. I already had um, a channel that I already uh, tested on. However, they ask you for the channel ID. Okay, the channel ID, and you need to authorize it. Um, so let's go to uh, our channel that we are going to test on it. Then we will come back. Here we have the channel. Let's go on. Here we have the channel that we are going to test on it. Um, in order for you to get the ID, this is the testing channel. Um, in order for you to get the ID of the channel, you go to um, the top uh, right hand side where you show your um, you know, icon or logo, whatever you like. Then you go to the account uh, or YouTube setting or account setting. Then you will see this part where it says overview of the account setting. You click on advance underneath the name of the channel or the account. And you will see over here um, your YouTube channel ID. You have a user ID and you have a channel ID as well as other information. However, you are going to choose the ID. Now, um, I'm going to uh, hide these information as we... Um, as I have it uh, live broadcast or uh, on YouTube. So you choose it. Um, then um, one more thing, you need to go um, and prepare your channel for live broadcasting. Now you come here on the logo uh, Creator Studio. You will go to the screen uh, live streaming. You click over there, and um, it asks you for using. Um, set up an encoding software which we already have one my channel till now is offline I didn't go live uh, you give the information about the channel the server information here when when you will go live you need to if you would like to have a chat you can have a chat with your visitors other information over here um, if you want to change the th uh, thumbnails you can and prepare it you're ready to go you already have the basic info then when you come back over here you will find the when you put the um, channel ID and you click on authorize it's going to ask you for login so you will provide the login information and immediately will put whatever uh, information in the setup for the live broadcast uh, or the live streaming on your channel so um, we we're ready to go. Let me uh, click OK. Um, I'm going to change the screen because uh, I'm going to have my full screen over there on the live broadcast part. So I'm going to remove this part and add a screen. Choose uh, my desktop again, and this is the desktop. Don't forget to uh, increase the size. Go to the output and click on this part give it a couple of seconds and it should give you the information about how you want it and you can click on start broadcasting click over there and you should be live broadcasting now what we are going to do uh, we will go back to the channel uh, let me go to open another channel um, this is the channel another browser click on the channel and it should be or it should say live broadcasting now we are live on YouTube so if you click over here actually you will see broadcasting now we are live on YouTube so if you click over here actually you will see so uh, you saw how um, it worked now you are seeing this part of um, the number of people watching and all other information um, because we are live uh, we are live. We are good health in terms of our, you know, best, better, you know, not an okay, but good uh, live streaming health. Uh, we have zero visitors. Let's see if we have more visitors. Uh, we have zero people watching. I don't know. Oh, I have one. Let me open my Mac and log in also to um to the live streaming. Now it should say live streaming on here. 
and yes we can go and um here yep and yes we can go and now i have two people watching one is um my mac and the other one is um me um should say two i don't know why we have one but yes uh, we have passing now we are live on youtube see um let me see how where we at i should say two over here let me go back let me make sure um zero people watching should say two people watching uh, okay two people watching okay so actually it's live broadcasting now i already mentioned that we are going to fix a problem with the live broadcast um if you have a black screen um that happen you don't see anything you sell you see the the crew the mouse or the you know the you see the mouse but you don't see actually anything black screen you need to go to your uh shortcut now they already said this is a uh, not good practice however it worked for me so i will uh tell you exactly what i did uh go to um let me uh, stop live broadcasting in thriving in a different location. So, uh, stop live broadcasting. Click over here. Now we are offline. And should be end soon. Click over here. And we are out of the program. Pro properties. You go, you go to the target. And you are going to put over here, if you have a problem with the black screen, you don't see anything, just your mouse, you will come here and after the quotations you will give space and you will have one space, not two actually, uh, one space, and you will have E-N-A-B-L-E-R-E-2. If you have the black screen problem, you don't see anything, you just put this and you apply it and you will be good to go. Um, I think uh, we are good for now how to live broadcast on YouTube using XSplit broadcast and fixing the black screen. So uh, see you in our upcoming videos and have a nice day and week.